what up everybody and thank you for clicking on this or one of my videos uh, of a 15 minute drawing challenge in this challenge I will be doing facial expressions as you can probably see by the title of it like made I don't know how many faces and so on so on time uh, in 15 minutes yeah, it's gonna be extreme facial expressions that's why I do see in the little corner I'm not sure which corner it would be for me, it's this corner, but for you, it's probably like that corner. Uh, my face will be there, so I could show you guys expressions of what I'm trying to do. I could look at myself in the corner and go like, yep, that's the expression I want to draw, uh, and so on and so forth. And, you know, like the 15-minute period. Let's get started. I'll, put, I'll open up the tabs. I was actually watching a video on how to do exactly just what I did with the face uh, not long ago, so I'm going to... Quickly go on to timer. The heck. Go there. Timer. Uh, uh, uh. And then, like usual, 15 minutes. Press start. And it should have already started. Just double check. I should have just. See, yep, it started. So we got 15 minutes to do as, uh, as many faces as possible. Let's do a quick expression and, and I'll look at myself. You look at how I look in the corner and then see if I can pull it off in that little time. Okay. Now, and I stood kind of quiet because I'm actually just studying myself in the process. All right, let's see, I draw a circle. No, kind of like if the, uh, doing a, what's it called, tongue, and it also be somewhere here, no, this is more lower actually, I'm trying, I'm trying to like pull it off as best as possible, and uh, my nose does this sort of thing. Now it's it's kind of stylized to a certain extent, so don't worry about it being perfect. I have headsets on, but I'll put ears because usually when you're doing uh, doing characters, you don't normally have them with headsets. Uh, what else? I just got a haircut, so I'm gonna do that sort of thing. Do a really quick cut. Mm, dun, dun, and then boom, and then you know just. Not a lot of hair, but you know, you want to get that uh, shape across. Okay, now the eyebrows are kind of like that. But the eyes, I'm going to do the eyes kind of like this, and then they're going to be just in the center. And then the neck is kind of tilted to the side a little, not too tilted. And you know, if you wanted to make it an anime character, you can't do this sort of thing where you just like that. That'll go more to that side, and so on and so forth. Boom, boom, and then the ears, just do that and that. Uh, I'm trying to simplify the ears so it's, it's going to be shaped like this and then a shape like that on the ear. So just letting y'all know. What else? Let's do another face really quickly. Uh, I don't know how much time we got, but let's do another one. Let's see. Yeah, I like this one. Like if I'm showing all my teeth up at the same time, so I'm gonna do uh, focus on that aspect of it.
and then just back out this side. I want to have this sort of thing happening to it, to the face. And then the nose would be somewhere here. Obviously big nose. You know, you can always do like a triangle, but then another triangle here, it, so it does this sort of shape. And here is the ball. Or you can even uh, do a circle and then see how that goes. Boom, circle, triangle, uh, rectangle right here. Erase that portion, erase this portion, erase this portion. And there you got yourself a nose really quickly. Uh, this goes connected to there, that goes connected to there. Uh, extreme face, extreme shading. Oh, it's, it's really stylistic faces. Uh, for that one, I'll have the eyes kind of looking up. I don't know. I'm trying to do this as quickly as possible. So, and then that. Maybe the eyebrows would be very nicely done. And that really quick shapes uh like if you understand anatomy that it kind of looks like if the uh, the neck portion of it will be right there let's have them have like a very long neck ears will be somewhere here and then this one will be kind of dangling for example erase some of it and like do you show the shape that we just talked about and then uh, same thing here, dangly ears, going outwards, shape, and then uh, let's do this sort of thing. So that's like some sort of shadow to a certain extent. And facial hair will be something like that. Hey, this will be an old man instead of a uh, me. Like if you if you're doing like a stylized character and you just wanna have the basic facial expression, but you just wanna uh, understand how that character will look, it doesn't always have to be the same character. There will be any character that you want, and then just have uh, yourself do the pose that you wanna do for the character. On the side, okay. I guess rid of that character, maybe some wrinkles, a uh, bigger forehead. And because of the light hitting it from the side or something, I don't know. Most of this is kind of improvised as you go. But I definitely want the teeth to uh, be very noticeable that they are all kind of like out there sort of thing. It looks kind of creepy. Okay, next uh, next drawing uh, of a face. Let's do another face. Like. Now, if we study that face really quickly, it's going to be obviously stretched out to the side. Uh, I saw very little teeth uh, in the inside. It kind of looked like it had kind of like buck teeth sort of showing, but it was probably because the other teeth were over here this was very stretched out for the mouth area and then since uh, this lip the bottom lip will be going inwards a little so it will be kind of lower than usual and then finger here and 
finger here. And, you know, obviously another finger there, another finger there, and another finger there, and so on and so forth. Let's see. Uh, it's not two fingers here, it'll be less fingers there, because most of the fingers will be down here. And then something like that. And then the thumb will be down here also, so. Now the hands is not really perfect, because right, we're trying to, instead of draw hands, we're trying to focus on drawing people expressions. So I'm going to select all this, scale it down, scale, come on. scale it down, and then go back to the drawing. As you can kind of see also, uh, let's see, this right here does this sort of shape, kind of like going inwards more than usual because trying to like make up for the shape that is missing so it does that let's see it kind of looks like it gets stretched out actually the sides so more like that and then because of the cheeks and oh get the things like that maybe this character will be pretend that those are getting stretched out trying to make sure that I don't go over some of the other characters in the process uh, but I don't make this character's head too big let's say that this one is going to be a character that's not humanoid so it's going to be like a sort of alien-like creature. Really quick sketches, really quick sketches. Nose. And triangle here. So it looks kind of like if his nose is popping out just a tiny bit. And then this would be like that. So, what else? Eyebrows. Just to, uh, this is just to add shape to, uh, to the head, uh, not at all to do anything else. What else? Add shade, uh, shade around here. Maybe close down the eyes a little bit. Because it looks like a, hey, he's smiling at you. Uh, all this is the, uh, the teeth that uh, gets shown, and all this is shaded. And stuff. What else? Oh. And you got three faces so far. Uh, what else can we do? Let's see how much time we have. Where's my mouse? We got two minutes, pretty much. Okay, so th uh, this is like the stretching point. Uh, let's see if I could scale this one entire face slightly down. I don't, I don't want to have everything take up so much space. Uh, I also want to fill up the canvas of every uh, here so then it does have something in every spot i got so used to the critter so i need to adjust to that let me zoom in so i try not to draw any bigger than this area right here uh, let's do another face that's still a very exciting excited face Yeah, because like when you squint, you also close up your eyes a little. Or or, or maybe like a face that it kind of is like excited, but at the same time not like 
Mm-hmm. Maybe I want, um, uh, I'm thinking maybe I want to start like, yeah, that, 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 that seems more like it. I kind of like that one. It is more like the lips are up. In the nose and then those the shin or yeah and then adjust some of it. It looks nice. Eyebrows. Maybe I have the eye kind of like that, and then look into the side. Pupil. Uh, and we move slightly lower. Have the neck. That neck will be connected here, and this will be the rest of the head. This will be where the hair will be at. Then I'll cut off somewhere here. Then this will be where the ear will be at. And like we, uh, we practice in the other ones, the ear is going to have this sort of shape. Just for simplistic sake. And the timer has already gone off, just letting you all know. But I'm just refining some of it. I don't know why my stylus is sliding on it so much. I'll stop it there because I'm kind of getting annoyed at the little sound this, it coming through my headset <laughs> from the timer. And let's go. To, nope. Timer. Press OK. And yeah, that's pretty much it. And, and you know, obviously, you know, if you wanted to refine it, just. It pretty much just like let's shade all that because that's where the hair is at. And if you wanted to add like really weird hair, you can do that. Obviously, make sure that this line is not very noticeable. Just there, like if you're gonna have it, at least have a whole load of freaking lines. In the process, so you can't tell that there's a line going exactly completely around there. Yeah. And those will be the 15 faces that I get to draw within this 15 minute period. Thank you all for joining me for uh, this wonderful video, and I hope that you had a great day and you will continue to have a great day or night either one i don't know where uh, what time or place you are don't really it uh, doesn't really matter to me as long as it's, uh, it matters to you anyways i'll see you all for the next video hopefully you do like and subscribe to this channel uh, or like this video subscribe to this channel ring the notification bell for more video and content like this where it's just like weird faces or anything in general uh, within 15 minute uh, period and I'll see you all. Peace. I should really say peace more often when I'm about to end the video not or when I'm about to like stop.